Okay, Kipsters, at this time we're going to solve problems that have to do with estimating area, volume, or circumference. So we'll read the question and we'll go through and interpret information properly. The toy company puts its toys in boxes to sell to customers. So far I know that I'm dealing with a toy company and it's selling toys in boxes to customers. The boxes are 2.3 feet tall. Now I see there's a formula over here, volume equals length times width. So tall is going to tell me what the h is. So I'm going to write h right next to 2.3 feet tall. Then 5.3 feet wide. Wide is going to tell me the w in the formula, volume equals length times width times height. So I'm going to write a w next to the 5.3 and a 9.4 and 9.4 feet long. Long is going to tell me length, so I'm gonna write an L next to that, 9.4. Estimate, I'm interpreting this information properly, so I know that I'm getting an estimation and not a, an exact answer. The volume, volume has to do with three dimensions. That's one, two, and your third dimension is right there. Of the box. Okay, so I now am looking at my numbers and I see that these numbers are decimal numbers. So I'm estimating and when I round decimal numbers, I round them to the nearest, when I round decimal numbers, decimal numbers, I round them to the nearest whole number. So I see that H is 2.3, L is, W is 5.3, 2.3 and length is 9.4 so I'm going to round these to the nearest whole number and there are two holes in 2.3 so I look to the right this digit 3 is between 0 and 4 so this stays the same so it's about 2 next I look at this next number I see that I have five holes and I look to the right, I see the digits between 0 to 4, so this number stays the same. So it's 5, about 5. And this number right here is 9.4. I round to the nearest hole, I have 9 of them. I look to the right, there is a 4, it's between 0 and 4, so this number stays the same. So it's about 9. Now I'm going to actually plug in all of my estimated answers into my estimated formula. Volume is about length times width times height. I wrote the formula. Now I'm going to substitute. I have not been told what V equals, so I'm going to write V is about length I've been told is about 9. Multiply that by W I've been told that's about 5. And height I've been told that is about 2. So now I'm going to solve. Volume is about 9 times 5 is 45. And copy everything else that has not been touched. 45 times 2. Let me do that off to the side. Work it. Two digit numbers. Is 90. So I've solved, and I've said that the variable is about 90. My last step is to write the unit, and I'm dealing with feet. Whenever I'm dealing with volume, I'm going to cube my unit. So cubic feet. 